Well, hey there, Community Bible Greenwood family. I hope you're having a great week. You know, it's been a very, very interesting last week in our community and especially in the life of our church. Obviously, we didn't meet last week due to the weather that came in and it's certainly been an interesting week around here on our Greenwood campus. So I wanna give you a quick update on what's going on on our campus. I'll let you know on Wednesday that we discovered that due to the extreme colds, a pipe had burst in our kids' ministry area on the bottom floor of our building. Uh, the extent of that water damage was pretty significant in all of our community kids' classrooms in some of our lobbies and a small portion of our worship center. But the great news is, is that restoration crews have been hard at work ever since we discovered it, and they are helping us get back to where we can have our kids' ministry and our children back in those rooms. But it's going to be a number of weeks. So here's what Sunday will look like. Sunday morning, we will have worship at 9 and 1030, and it will be family-style worship. We will all be together in the worship center. Our community kids portion of our building is going to be closed for a few weeks until we can get it finished and get it ready where it's safe for our kids to worship. But church, I think this is a fantastic opportunity for families to come and worship together in one room, and I really am looking forward to it. It's, and I want you to know that I don't want this to be something that keeps you away. I want it to be an opportunity for you to grab your kids, grab your family, grab those you worship with, and let's all be together at 9 or 10.30 in the same room to worship our Lord together. I'm going to be preaching this Sunday the message I was going to preach last Sunday, which is on our value of multi-generational. And there is not a better time for us to talk about this than this Sunday as we look at our Next Generation Ministries and what that means and, and why it's so important for us to follow the mandates of Scripture and the commands of God to teach our children to love Jesus and to love Him with our heart, soul, mind, and strength. And so we're going to talk about that together on Sunday as we continue moving in our Driven series. So I want you to be here. On a practical note, I have lots to update you about our building, about what's coming in the next few weeks, decisions that uh, we will have to make as a church about how we move forward with some of the things we need to do in our kids' ministry area. And I need you as the church to be here. This is a, a church of, of people who love kids, who love next generation, who love students. And so I need you to be here this Sunday with your family, not only as we continue our series, not only as we worship together, but also as we talk about what the next few weeks and months are going to look like, which I believe are going to shape much of what we do in the years to come in our children's ministry. So don't miss this Sunday. I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a great day. Get your family together, make plans, and be here this Sunday morning at Community Bible Greenwood at 9 or 1030, and I will look forward to seeing you there. Have a great weekend.